process of distillation, perforation, and nitrogenation, a maple concentrate can make an effective homegrown solution to our nation's chemical warfare needs. One scientist was quoted saying, if we can do it with mustard, we can do it with maple. Let us put some in the science spinner and see what happens. Watch the science spinner go round and round. Now we are ready to test our new weaponized syrup gas using the concentrated solution delivery device. We will bring in a randomly selected Newfoundlander, spray him down, and observe. Oh dear. He seems to enjoy it. That will not do at all. Now let's see what our boys in Canadian Aerospace have cooked up. This is the first ever maple powered rocket. Let's watch. Oh dear. That will not do at all. Some scientists theorize that maple, being as sticky as it is, has potential to slow, deter, or even stop high-velocity projectiles. We will put that theory to the test. Let's bring back our Newfoundlander. We'll spray him down again. Then we will see if the syrup is capable of stopping a Canadian firearm. At point-blank range. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a total failure. As any good scientist knows, we can't base any conclusions over one failed test. To rule out potential confounding variables, we must run 10 tests on 10 more Newfoundlanders and get a statistically significant result. No. No. Nope. This guy looks pretty hosed. Let's see how he holds up. My god, it worked! Syrup has a 10% confirmed effectiveness rating, better than the finest Canadian Kevlar. Well done, boys. This is a glorious day for Canada, and therefore, the world. Some in the scientific community have suggested that maple syrup could make an effective camouflage. Let's see how our Newfoundlander blends into the background. Oh, oh, oh dear. That, that does not work at all. This is... this is hard to watch. Uh, can we just... can can we just stop there? Yes, can we please, shall we? Can we stop? Thank you. Uh, thanks for watching, unless you weren't supposed to be watching. Then you're a very bad person. We asked nicely. You should feel ashamed. Good day.